So for today's experiment, we are going to try to cut a record on something you would never imagine cutting a record on. I found this at my local Dollar Tree. It is called Microwave Cooking Covers. And in this package, I got two covers for a dollar. So the first cover you see there on the turntable already on my record cutter. And you see the cutting tool that I use to cut the holes in the record. So I use this hole punch here to cut two holes in the center of the disc. And I thought I'd show you this because I've done a lot of videos and I haven't really uh, shown you guys how I make the holes in the disc. This is a hole puncher that you would purchase for leather use and it's a 9 30 seconds hole punch. And you can see from all the plastic plates that I've cut holes in, there's all the centers of those hanging out there in that little place right there. Kind of hard to get out too. So anyway, I have not yet tried to record on a microwave cooking uh, cover yet, but uh, we will find out together whether or not this works. Now, I'm only going to be able to record on one side of this, and the reason, just about like the magnifying glass or magnifying sheet that I cut on in another one of my videos, this side has a smooth side, and then it also has a grooved side. You can see the grooves there. So, obviously, it would, it would be tough to cut into this because you'd be cutting across those grooves there. So, we can cut on this side. Now, this particular package comes with two different sizes. It comes with a 7-inch and a 9-inch. So, we're going to cut on the 9-inch one first. They are reusable and they're dishwasher safe. So the good thing about it is if I make a recording on here, then I can wash them in the dishwasher should they get dirty. Isn't that cool? So um, what we're going to use as our source material today is I went to a radio station not long ago and a buddy of mine who works for this local radio station here in Festus, Missouri, where I live, just south of St. Louis, he uh, invited me in to come in and record some text, uh, so or some some spoken word stuff. So I recorded a, a public service announcement about breast cancer. So don't laugh, you know it's 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 a very real thing. If you've ever had a family member uh, die of breast cancer, then you know how real it is. So uh, he asked me to record these little PSAs for him, and I recorded two 30-second ones. So we'll go ahead and play those and ins uh, inscribe them onto this uh, microwave cooking cover. So let's go ahead and get that started. My source material is going to be my little win book that has those two MP3 files recorded on it. And you can see a review of this win book on my channel as well. So let's go ahead and get that queued up. Got the unit on here. I'm going to go ahead and log in, and uh, you can see I've got the media player open right there, and it is ready to go. So my record cutter's on. I've got it on record microphone, and the tablet is connected to the microphone input. All right, so let's go ahead and get the planter started, and you guys can hear what I sound like if I was on the radio. Hopefully you like it. You can leave a comment and let me know how well I did, okay? So here we go. So let's get her spinning and play. This year in America, more than 211,000 women will be diagnosed with breast cancer and over 43,000 will die. But breast cancer is not exclusively a disease of women. For every 100 women with breast cancer, one male will develop the disease. This is National Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Bloomsdale Bank in Crystal City and Herculaneum and Medicine Shop in Festus encourage you to support the National Breast Cancer Foundation. Okay, that was the first one. And then we're going to go to the second one here. Breast cancer raises a lot of questions. Does physical activity reduce the risk of breast cancer? The National Breast Cancer Foundation offers this answer. A woman who exercises four hours per week reduces her risk of breast cancer. Exercise I am hearing a little bit of noise on the disc as it's cutting it. So, and I'm not seeing the usual trail of swarf that we should see either. Okay, 
All right, so I'm not sure how good this is going to sound, but I guess we'll find out. So again, we didn't get the swarf off of there that we normally do. So I'm not sure what's going on with that part of it. Let's go ahead and stop it for a second and take a look. Take a look at the grooves that we just cut. So there they are. Yeah, you can see there's, there's little waves of uh, white in here, which is probably going to be audible in the recording. So, yep, yeah, you can see them there. So, not quite sure what this material is doing, but it doesn't look like it cuts very well. All right, let's play it back and see what happens. I'll go ahead and switch it over to Phono. That was the radio we heard in between there. This could be very unpleasant sounding. Here we go. Well, that is horrible, just as I uh, suspected. Alright, well that sounds absolutely horrible. So, uh, you know, not every substance that I uh, record on is a good substance for recording. There's just something about the plastic material that doesn't, uh, doesn't do so well. So, since that didn't do very well, you may want to say, well, I didn't really get to hear your radio recording very clearly because, well, because uh, it was so noisy. So let's go ahead and put on one of my usual plastic plates, and we will cut into that and see how I sound on a plastic plate. Sound like a good idea? And we should see our normal amount of swarf with this particular uh, recording process. So let's go back to recording mic. Crank it up a bit. Turn it on. Oh yeah, nice and quiet cut. Here we go. Breast cancer raises a lot of questions. Does physical activity reduce the risk of breast cancer? The National Breast Cancer Foundation offers this answer. A woman who exercises four hours per week reduces her risk of breast cancer. Exercise pumps up the immune system and cuts the estrogen level. Festus Manor in Festus and Crystal City Library in Crystal City encourage you to give yourself a breast exam once a month. Good old reliable plastic plates. Here's the other one. We'll try it too. This year in America, more than 211,000 women will be diagnosed with breast cancer, and over 43,000 will die. But breast cancer is not exclusively a disease of women. For every 100 women with breast cancer, one male will develop the disease. This is National Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Bloomsdale Bank in Crystal City and Herculaneum and Medicine Shop in Festus encourage you to support the National Breast Cancer Foundation. So there we go. We've made a recording. Now this should actually be listenable. Good patrol. Tried and true. Good old blue here. Breast cancer raises a lot of questions. Does physical activity reduce the risk of breast cancer? The National Breast Cancer Foundation offers this answer. A woman who exercises four hours per week reduces her risk of breast cancer. Exercise pumps up the immune system and cuts the estrogen level. Festus Manor in Festus and Crystal City Library in Crystal City encourage you to give yourself a breast exam once a month. And not too bad. Let's see how the second one sounds. This year in America, more than 211,000 women will be diagnosed with breast cancer, and over 43,000 will die. But breast cancer is not exclusively a disease of women. For every 100 women with breast cancer, one male will develop the disease. This is National Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Bloomsdale Bank in Crystal City and Herculaneum and Medicine Shop in Festus encourage you to support the National Breast Cancer Foundation. 
Well, there's a little bit of a speed uh, variation there, as you heard. I sounded a little bit more like this, like I just sucked in a little bit of helium just before I made the recording. But uh, in any case, uh, I can't recommend these microwave cooking covers as a recording medium, unfortunately. So, lesson learned. Never know what you're going to get. Well, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. You can uh, see all kinds of record cuttings on my channel. I uh, cut into a Blu-ray disc, a CD, a RCA Selectivision video disc, a laser disc, plastic plates, and of course I cut a record on a uh, magnifying sheet as well. I looked for those magnifying sheets this time and uh, they didn't have any. so. It's one thing about the dollar store, it's it's here today and gone tomorrow. But uh, hey, I would just want to give a, a shout out to all you guys who have subscribed to my channel and thank you for subscribing, thank you for, for faithfully watching videos as I make them each week and um, thank you for being a friend and uh, sharing your experiences in your electronics hobbies as well. I will catch you on the next video.